to integrate sin x over sin x minus a, we'll have to first simplify the denominator. For that, we'll substitute x minus a with t, giving us dx is equal to dt. Our numerator sin x will become sin t plus a and the denominator sin x minus a will become sin t. Now, in the numerator, we can apply sin sum formula and replace sin t plus a with sin t cos a plus cos t sin a. We can now separate the two terms and we observe that in the first term sin t gets cancelled out and in the second term cos t over sin t can be replaced with cot t. Now here we have constant in both the terms so we can take the constant out giving us cos a integration of dt plus sin a integration of cot t dt. Now we can do these two integration easily. We know that integration of dt is equal to t and integration of cot t is log of absolute of sin t. From both the integration we get the constant term which we have combined and represented here as c1. Now we can substitute t back in terms of x giving us cos a x minus a plus sin a log of absolute sin x minus a plus c1. We can further expand the first term giving us x cos a minus a cos a. Here minus a cos a is a constant term so we can combine this constant term with our previous constant term c1 giving us a new constant c. 